So why do we care about near-Earth asteroids? Well, the reason we care is that they occasionally impact. And when they do, they do that with energies of thousands of nuclear bombs. We are now living in an age where we can actually find those objects and know whether something like that might happen. And we're actually living in an age where we can do something about it. Large Synoptic Survey Telescope, or LSST, will have a major impact on our knowledge of asteroids and mapping the solar system. ZDF, the Zwinki Transit Facility, it's a new wi extreme wide field telescope housed in Caltech. And with this influx of, of new data, astronomers have to look to new tools to draw science from this huge volume of data that's coming from these survey telescopes. Um, data and the software behind the data is really what we are craving and what we need in order to advance our science. ATOM project. Uh, ATOM stands for Asteroid Decision and Analysis Mapping Platform. Is there a more natural or intuitive framework that we could shift to allowing a telescope to choose how it wants to observe the night sky but also still discover asteroids? With new techniques we can get new results from old data. All the telescopes in the world that switched to these new types of cameras, they became 10 times bigger overnight just by switch to new technology. That was a revolution. Only in the last 30 years or so that we've had the technology and the algorithms and the software that allows us to compete with the human brain in detecting and identifying asteroids as they move across the sky. If you look at the stars, they are beautiful, but you really don't understand much. But with all the telescope involvement that we have, the amount of knowledge and the amount of science we can extract is really incomprehensible. 